What's up everyone? My name is Nick. I'm John. I'm Grace. And I'm Poochie McTaggart. G'day. And you're watching Global Gibbon. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> We're in Kuching, as always, and we are exploring the city once again, but this time we're focusing on the murals. There's a bunch of murals throughout the city, painted on the walls, and we're just going to check them out, and we're going to see what the kids think, and yeah, we're just going to have a fun day. Grace, which one do you like the most out of all these? <laughs> and why do you like that one? I like cats. I like cats through the lot. <laughs> and science. And I also like space and flight. <laughs> I also think there's a nice mural right up here. Let's check it out. So a few years ago, they started making the city more beautiful with all these murals. And I think one of the first ones was a project by Petronas. They sponsored it. And they had three beautiful murals painted by local artists. Let's check out the first one. John, look for the faces. The mural with the faces. This painting is one of the first three paintings that were commissioned by Petronas and this one depicts four local children of all different races. Let's check out the second big one. Up here we've got the hornbill, which is the national emblem of Sawa. Beautiful creature. If you ever get over here, make sure you catch yourself an eye full of hornbill. Here we are once again, walking along Main Bazaar from one spot to another and even though this is not a mural but look at this painting that's beautiful Now walking to the third uh, Petronas mural, and this is of a cat. Of course, Kuching, people associate that with a cat. Here we go, check it out. Yep, it's a bloody hot, hot enough to fry an egg on your forehead right now. The cat looks good. Alright, the next spot is through this alley called the Bishop's Gate and there's a mural there and we're going to go to the back alley where there's a bunch of murals, graffiti and just a cool place to check out. So 
here we are nice and hot at the back alley behind Carpenter Street, which is about 200 meters from the waterfront, as you can see in my previous videos. And they've made a beautiful long mural here with a lot of graffiti and cool things. They've even based one section on the very popular game PUBG, which everyone plays these days. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. They've got these cool, I think they are Mexican wrestling masks here. And uh, there's an elephant there, there's a totem pole, just a bunch to see here. walking to another beautiful mural and this is made of the tinsmiths. There's a lot of very traditional tinsmiths here in Kuching and this mural is dedicated to them. <laughs> so we're continuing our way towards India Street, which is in my previous video as well. And there's a bunch of mural murals that I didn't put in my previous video. So go with us and check it out. There's always something you find here while walking in Kuching that you've never seen or these cool little features that are just so unique like this little door. Where does it go? The staircase goes upstairs but there's no sign, it's, it's interesting. Garrett just said that he thinks it's a portal to another dimension. G'day. Now, it doesn't happen every day. But sometimes you come across something so amazing, an artwork so phenomenal that it just blows your mind. I mean, how, how did someone come up with this? It's incredible. After those interesting encounters, we continue walking towards India Street. Like I said earlier, we're gonna check out <laughs> we're gonna check out the little side streets because there's a lot of murals there. And our final destination, our final destination, are the orangutans in the wheelbarrow. So here's something that I learned today. Apparently, this mural is the largest augmented reality mural in all of Malaysia. Now that's an interesting fact. We're ending the day at a mural made by Ernest Zekarevich, if I'm pronouncing that correctly. He is a painter from Europe somewhere, and he came to Malaysia and he did some beautiful murals in Penang, which is in West Malaysia. And here he came to Kuching and made some cool murals like the one behind him.
that's the end of the video. We hope you liked it. We hope you enjoyed this video as much as we like making it. If you liked it, leave a thumbs up, leave a comment, make sure to subscribe, and we'll see you next week. Bye! Bye! Bye. Bye.